Hey world, how's it going y'all? Yeah, kind of in a chill mood today. So instead of doing homework like I should be and studying for midterms and finals, what am I doing? I'm making a YouTube video and listening to JLS. I kind of feel like I'm pulling the Aston look today. But that's because I have like really bad hair and I didn't have time to straighten and curl it. And I didn't want to put in a ponytail, so I'm beaning it up today. So what I want to talk about this week is, so one of the things I want to talk about is Black Friday. Like, this is like the first year that I've ever heard of like Canada having Black Friday. So usually my mom goes down to the States and gets like good deals on like clothes and stuff and brings them back up. But she brought like the randomest things back. Okay, like, I guess they have these in like other places, but I've never seen them before. Like in hand, but I've seen them in like videos and stuff. So I guess you like rub these together. They're called hand warmers and you like squeeze them and they warm your hands. I think that's pretty cool. And then, how cute are these? They're little juice boxes. I don't know if this is the size of every single juice box in the States, but if it is, that's freaking cute. And it's backwards, so you can't really read it because it's a mirror. But like, it says juicy juice. And look at, okay, like, I'm from Canada, right? So, if you didn't know that, obviously you did. But like, we have half our stuff in English and half our stuff in French. This stuff is half in Spanish. That's cool. I've never had Spanish stuff. So now when I take Spanish next time, I'm going to take this and I'm going to study it. Mm -hmm. So besides that, I kind of have a personal topic I want to talk about and it's kind of hard because I've been through it many times and I think that I just, yeah, so I should talk about it. Why boys feel the need to chase girls, but then once the chase is over. They don't really care. I'm pretty sure most girls go through this. And I'm saying gays too. I'm not discriminating. Why don't I keep playing with this? Okay. So this is how usually it starts out. Just in my personal experience. I meet a guy. Guy meets me. We start texting. And it's all good. Then we start hanging out. And it's all good. And then like things are starting to finally get good. And maybe it turns to a relationship. The guy then all of a sudden just like turns into a total dickhead and does not talk to you. Like, I don't know if it's because most guys that I know are scared of like commitment in relationships, but maybe if they freaking talk to me or like other girls, they realize that like a lot of girls don't want like huge commitments right now. Like, I'm only 18, almost 19. I don't need a super serious relationship. Like, if you want like an op open, what you call it, relationship, or like you don't want to be like labeled as boyfriend girlfriend I'm fine with that you know I don't care I used to care about labels when I was younger like in my earlier teens and stuff but now I, I honestly don't care I've matured I realized that you know who I'm probably gonna date in the next like year I'm probably not gonna get married with and have kids with so why do we need to make it serious now as long as you and I both like each other and we have fun together and you're not an asshole and you're a pretty fun nice guy to hang out with and why do we need to label it? Like, let's just be whatever we be. And that whole friends with benefits. I'm not saying that. I'm just saying, like, I would never say, like, again, like, I would never label as a guy a friend if I was hanging out and, like, dating him. But I would never label him as my boyfriend if he didn't want that. What I'm saying is, I feel like guys, they love the chase to get a girl's attention. But then, once they think they got it, then they start being, like, dickheads, like, it takes one word answers and I don't know about you but like when I talk to someone and they say one word answers it's like you can tell something's up so what's going on nothing are you okay I'm fine what are you doing tonight something if someone said that to you in real life you'd be like what the hell but on texting it's like you don't know what to say you don't know what to do when people say like K hey, or like, yep. I, the second you realize, you know what? There's more fish in the sea. There's a million other people I can spend time with that appreciate my time. It's like then they reel you back in. And you think, oh no, they've changed. They realized that they need me and all this bullshit, which is not true. And so you go back and the same bullshit happens. Because all girls just want is to be treated right and have the attention that we deserve. So.
Hey.